Now I'm making sure the telescope's camera is white field balanced and wishing you had a coloring book. <laughs> Good news, gentlemen. Amy's at a conference this weekend, which means I'm available to be entertained. As today's youth might put it, who wants to get their shelled on? Bernie and I are getting the house ready for the remodel. Could always use an extra pair of hands. That sounds awful, Raj. Uh, I've got time booked in the telescope room all weekend, scanning for rogue planets. You're more than welcome to join me. That's the one to beat, Leonard. Oh, if anything, I'm trying to get my shelled off. <laughs> What are you doing? Uh, making sure the telescope's camera is white field balanced. Hmm. What are you doing now? Still making sure the telescope's camera is white field balanced. Oh, I see. How about now? <laughs> Now I'm making sure the telescope's camera is white field balanced and wishing you had a coloring book. Well, I can be helpful. Give me something to do. You know, my father took me to work once, and in 10 minutes, I figured out who'd been stealing from the cash register. It was my father. <laughs> now, Dad lost his job, but Mr. Hinckley gave me a fudge sickle. Fine. You want something to do? There's about six months of data on this hard drive. Why don't you go through it and see if you can spot any patterns or anomalies? Yep, I'm on it. Hey, look at that, an Indian guy outsourcing a computer job to a white fella. <laughs> yeah, okay, whatever it takes to keep you busy for a few hours. Found one. <laughs> no, you didn't. There are millions of data points there. But look, an optical transient. Yeah, maybe that is something. How did you find that? It wasn't difficult. You know how when you see prime numbers, they appear red, but when they're twin primes, they're pink and smell like gasoline? No. Huh. I guess I'm a special boy. Okay, the final image is coming in. And the object we discovered is... Come on, Daddy needs a livable planet he can rule with an iron fist. A medium-sized asteroid. That's it? How common. That's the chicken fingers on the menu of space. I kind of like chicken fingers. Yeah, me too. I was stuck for a metaphor. A medium-sized asteroid is still an interesting discovery. I suppose it could end up on a collision course with Earth and destroy life as we know it. You dream different than me. <laughs> it is kind of cute. Yeah, it is. And you know we get to name it. <gasps> do we better choose a name no one can make fun of? Sir Frederick William Herschel didn't do Uranus any favors. 